Now, your eyewitness weather forecast. Well, good morning. After a chilly and a foggy start to our day today, the fog has finally burned off for the most part, and that sun really going to be winning out through this afternoon, and temperatures are starting to rebound quite nicely. Here in Lehighton, it's a great end to the morning. It'll be a great afternoon with a good deal of sun. Temperatures that end up climbing back into the 60s for today. That's after some spots started off in the 30s earlier this morning. This very weak cold front is going to pass through the area a little bit later on today. As it does that, it doesn't have a lot of moisture working with it. Most of that moisture right now is well off the coast. So all we really see is a few clouds mix in. As far as rain is concerned, really does not look like an issue for us as we go through today. Temperatures are lagging behind a little bit in the areas where we had the worst of the fog this morning, like Williamsport and Sealands Grove. Actually, Williamsport, we're still struggling in the 40s. Wilkesbury and Scranton 61 and Hazleton coming in right around 61. So that's sunshine really beginning to make a difference at this point. And temperatures will make it to the lower and the mid 60s for today. The average high for this time of year comes in right around the lower 60s. So right near, if not just above average for this time of year. And then look what happens this evening. We are quickly back down to the 40s and there will be spots waking up in the 30s by tomorrow morning. So there's that front going through. Remember, it doesn't have a lot of moisture working with it. So we just see a few clouds mix in. This area of high pressure then settles in through the night tonight. As it does that, it actually clears out the sky a little bit more, lets that temperature drop a little more overnight. And then after that, we have a nice day on Tuesday with plenty of sun. As Wednesday comes around, this cold front comes around. And this has a lot of moisture going with it, so that's going to be a good soaking rainfall right in the middle of the day Wednesday, even going into Wednesday evening. That eventually kicks out of here. Then we have lingering cloud cover and really what ends up being an isolated shower by the time we go into Thursday but the day looks mainly dry. We could use this rain though. Over the last 30 days, most spots are running in about a two to even a three inch deficit in rainfall. So getting an inch or two of rain going into Wednesday is certainly going to be beneficial for us. We're still doing okay for the year for the most part, but that rain will certainly be helpful. Then after that rain goes through, Watch what happens. Much cooler air starts to slide back into place. Keep an eye on the timing here right around Thursday and into Friday. It'll be much cooler with temperatures not even getting out of the 50s. Mid 60s though for the high today in your eyewitness weather forecast. Clouds break for sun or continue to do that and it's nice and pleasant with our wind at around 5 to 10 miles per hour. We're down near 40 tonight, 62 tomorrow. Nice day again tomorrow, but the rain moves in Wednesday. Then here's the cool down 54 and 58 Thursday and Friday, much more sunshine by Friday, Saturday and Sunday are looking great mix of clouds and sun temperatures are comfortably in the mid 60s and the eyewitness weather app can be taken with us on the go. We download that to our phones and tablets. The forecast is of course always available for you as well at PA homepage. Dot com. So Chris, Wednesday is going to be quite the soaker, but the good news is it's rain that we need. The better news is that rain's not around for the weekend. Uh, it's Monday, but we can already talk about what an amazing weekend we it can. looks like coming yes. up, right? All yeah. right, thanks, Stephanie. Well, seeking.